We are excited to bring in our next guest. They are one of the best known duos in entertainment, and now they are back for a second season of their design competition series, Making the Cut. Tim Gunn and Heidi Klum joining us this Good morning. morning. Good morning. We are so thrilled to have you both back here on GMA. Come on, you all uh, have been- Thank you for having us. Always, always. It is hard to believe that you all have been working together for 17 years now. So to borrow- well, how lucky am I? <laughs> <laughs> to borrow your phrase, I always phrase, say, Tim, Tim and I, it's the longest marriage, the longest marriage I've ever been in. It's amazing. Yeah. I didn't, I didn't want to go never there. Fight. I didn't want to go there. We still love each other. <laughs> you said, how, but how do you all make it work? To use, this, to use Tim's phrase, how do you make it work? Well, I, I have to say, we, we, we really do love and adore each other and we have great respect for each other and we share so many of the same values. Um, we have our differences. I mean, I will say, I think we're, we're fashion's oddest couple, but that's what makes us work, Robin. Yeah, and we just, we love, you know, the industry that we're in. We still live and breathe fashion, so we do definitely have that in common. And when I think about this 17 years, my oldest child is now 17 years. I wow. mean, Tim has seen me, <laughs> I mean, not seen me giving birth, but breastfeeding <laughs> and going through all these different phases with, with all my four children. It's, you know, it's been a long ride. It's been a very fun ride, hopefully for many more years to come. Oh, we, I, I'm 17 more at least. Yeah, at least, at least 17 more. And on the first scene of, of the show, we saw you travel, you and the contestant travel from New York to Paris, to Tokyo for inspiration. Well, this season you couldn't travel. So how did that is affect the show? I think everyone was so cooped up for the last year and a half, you know, during the pandemic that everyone was so excited to even film. You know, once we got the green light that, hey, we can actually film Making the Cut season two, we were super excited. So everyone, I guess, you know, was, super happy to finally be doing something and also our um, designers come from so many different parts of the world you know we have someone from australia france um colombia america so people are from all over the place and they already bring so much you know from wherever they're from and you know what their story is about so there was definitely not a lack of inspiration there so yes it's always fun to travel and go into all these different capitals of the world but um you know they are super talented people and they have the inspiration just you know inside of them it's Thank true, you. and we thought, if we can't travel the world, we'll bring the world to us, and we yeah. did. Yeah, found the inspiration from within. Well, we're gonna take a look at a clip of the show right now. Let's check it out. This is so crazy. Tim, I have to tell you, this <laughs> carnival is so much fun. Heidi, for me, it's surreal. I feel like a kid again, and in that spirit, I think we should ride the Ferris wheel after the fashion show. Oh, I would love that, just you and I. Absolutely, it's like something out of a romantic Ooh. comedy. <laughs> Very cute. Love it. Uh, we were just so happy to be doing something, period. I have to tell you. I mean, when we saw each other, because, you know, shooting this got pushed and pushed and pushed so many times that when it actually was happening, we were like really like kids in yeah. on a carnival, you know? You, you can it's feel true. that you can see that in the clip for sure. We want to take advantage, by the way, of you all being here and your fashion expertise. So we're going to ask you a couple questions, see if some certain trends that are here now are going to stick around. So I'll start with you, Tim. Dad pants. Oh, absolutely the worst. <laughs> I'm always saying the more volume the clothes have, the more volume you appear to have. Mm. Don't do it. <laughs> I love that. That's really good advice. All right, Heidi, you're next. Crop tops. Um, I feel like if you want to wear it, rock it. I don't always think that there's a right or a wrong. Definitely when we're looking for new designs, you know, we always want to look for something that is new and fabulous. But I feel like everyone should be able to wear what they want to wear. So if you want to wear a crop top, go for it. Tim, I want to see you in one. <laughs> <laughs> His face says it all. All right, Tim, puff sleeves. Well, if you're Heidi Klum, you can do it. But you have to be very uh, careful about the scale and, and relative to your own proportions. It, it can be tasty, but it can also be fabulous, as Heidi's demonstrating. Yes. She do, you, do you like yes. my cuffs? Yeah, she look, yes. you look amazing in about anything, I imagine, Heidi. Uh, what about mm -hmm. jean shorts? I say yes. 
Also yeah. on the jean shorts. I mean, for me, they've kind of gotten a little bit longer. They used to be shorter, but um, now since there's a second butt, the shorts have gone a little bit longer. <laughs> I agree. No Daisy Dukes. <laughs> oh, you, you, you two are amazing. You guys say. are adorable. Absolutely adorable. <laughs> Thank you for bringing the sunshine this morning to GMA. Bless you both. Thank you. Y'all take you. care. <laughs> she did. She did say that, right? Yes. Oh, yes. yes. <laughs> uh, season two of Making the Cut premieres tomorrow on Amazon Prime. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.